Championship Sunday, the two of the top three Division III softball teams in the nation just happened to be in Hampton Roads. And today, they met for the right to play in next weekend's NCAA Super Regional. Let's go to Newport News. Virginia Wesleyan, number one ranked team in the nation and the defending national champs against third ranked Christopher Newport University. Is this the captain's year? Fifth inning, we're tied at one. Patty Mayohanian, the ODAC Rookie of the Year, left field. That's a home run. You saw Madison Globke, the outfielder, hit the wall hard. She was checked out, was okay, thankfully. CNU takes a 2-1 to one lead. The Marlins respond in the bottom half of the inning. Caitlin Biando, out of Nansman River in Suffolk, hugs the first base line. Two runs are in. Biando's in with a triple. And the Marlins are back on top, 3-2 to two and fired up. Sixth inning, it's a 5-2 to two Wesleyan lead. Jessica Lindsay with a shot to left and a little insurance. Two-run RBI makes it 7-2. to Hannah Hall in the circle goes the distance. Seven innings gets her 33rd win of the season. Wesleyan is super again. 7-2 to the final. Uh, but look out, Coach Brandon Elliott gets the ice bath water, gets the ice water bath, and good enough to give us a few words afterwards. They're big rivals of ours. Um, you know, got a lot of friends, recruited a lot of the same kids. Um, go back and forth on the other side of the water. Um, you know, it's a dogfight. You know, we played them four times this season. Um, they've all been tight games, and uh, to be able to win, you know, all four, them, all four of them was huge. It's just awesome. It's a really, you know, we knew we were going to have to face them, and at first, you know, it was kind of like, dang, you know, this this isn't going to be the best. But we came out, and we responded really well, and I think that you know we did really great this weekend. Not the easiest celebration, though, for Globke, the sophomore outfielder out of Ocean Lakes High School in Virginia Beach. Right there this week, we shared her story and how she lost her mother, Marjorie, to cancer just last fall. Last year, we did it on Mother's Day, and I had my mom here. And then this year, I don't have her here, but we got this big win for her. So um, I know she's like looking down on us. And for it to be against seeing you makes it even better. The picture of all the moms kind of hurt a little bit just because... Um, but when she was here, and Coach gave us a rose to give to our moms, but when I get home, I'm just going to go take it, take it to where she is and tell her how, how much I love her. Sure, she's proud. Marlins will face Berry College in the Super Regional Round.